What's up everyone? It's me. This is my new phone so you can see how ugly my face truly is with my new phone. But um, <laughs> anyway, so I got to thinking after watching a Prepared Minds video. And I, I, I truly get that yes, despite what the media says, that we live in a safer time than we probably have for history and throughout the entire history. But um, one thing I've noticed with all these crazy shootings and everything is that it seems like they're trying to send us a message. <clears throat> now, several people have told me they believe the elites are really um scared of the middle class and people getting pissed off and I think that uh, they're pretty much sending us a message by publicizing all these crazy shootings and things like Oregon and I think the message is that uh, they want us to see is that if anyone rises up and tries to you know um, draw arms against the uh, power structure that it'll be squashed right there in place so uh, <laughs> I mean sending robots in to blow dudes up and Oregon and you you name it they sure are making a big to do about it so uh, I think they're really scared of us rising up against them and pointing guns at them and shit they don't want people to believe that they have the power so other than that uh, I ordered a couple more vapors a 545 and a 762 by 39 20 inch models 20.5 inch models and uh, I figured I'd get those in case Hillary does win and it there's a big panic you know they haven't really come in for years and uh, so I figured that was a good idea to go ahead and get since I'm all um, <coughs> invested in the 762 by 39 and 54 I was considering getting some crazy you know uh, like a 308 or something but I, I don't want any more calibers I wanted a 545 so my wife and kids can shoot comfortably and wasn't thinking about uh, making it really like my main go-to rifle or anything but uh i i just figured it'd be a cool thing to have at least for people that are um you know don't like recoil or new shooters to have so i i just you know i'm probably not going to get thousands upon thousands of rounds for the 545 but either way it's it'll be cool to have you know i could always sell it and the uh, retail for Vepper 545s go, they they hold pretty well. So, uh, <clears throat> so yeah, I, I thought it was a good idea with all the um, panic buying that may go down soon. You know, Vepers are high quality rifles. You know, they have big ass barrels. And uh, so yeah, I'm definitely excited. And for the 762 by 39 Vepper, I got a 20.5 inch in case I want to use it for hunting or something. Like a Supreme Hog hunting rifle. That and my 54 that I still have. So I'm finally going to get um, into um, modifying them and everything since, <clears throat> you know, I had to move and my, my family members have died and everything. So, uh, yeah, I'm really excited. I thought it was a good idea. Another thing is the AR market is so cheap right now. So, um, that's probably a good investment as well. But the uh, Vepers, I thought, were a, um, were probably, I haven't seen the 545s and 762s come in hardly for years. And I figured it would be now or never. So I'm really excited about that. Take care.